is this soul. man walking around? We said, oh no, here he come. But I said, you better listen to him because he's telling the truth. Because yeah. it was on a movie where the man walking around saying, you better come to God now because you don't know when he's coming. He said every time he go through that campground and start preaching. I said, you better listen to him. He said, God going to come like a thief in the night. You don't know when he coming. Boom. Just like that. Somebody could be hitting a stem and here he come. Ain't that, ain't that crazy? That's the truth. Look, somebody be doing this. Mm. And here come God. Busting out the sky. Ooh, la la. You better not. That's the truth. <laughs> Ooh la la. <laughs> That's Jacqueline. a happy thing. <laughs> exactly. Miss, don't count your days. Make your days count. Don't count your days, but make your days count. You got to do this. That's just like, don't eat to live, live to eat. Yes, ma'am. Yes, uh -huh. ma'am. Everybody's Ooh, been loving you, Miss Jacqueline. They love your spirit. They love everything about you. Well, babe. I've been there, did it, and done it. I've been the dump truck that got renewed. I wasn't thrown away, but somebody wanted to throw me away. But God said, not yet. Most definitely. Most definitely. I don't know what else to say because I'm kind of tired today. I did party a little bit. But when I'm well rested, you can get that boost of energy like power aid. <laughs> yes, ma'am, Miss Miss Jacqueline, you said enough from the last interview. We know your spirit, we know your heart, we know you are a lover of God, and that's what matters. Well, I'm like Stevie Wonder. I'm walking by faith and not by sight, and I can I don't have my eyes, but I can feel with my heart. That's how you know a good spirit and a bad spirit. Most definitely. And I hate to tell y'all, but I'm leaving in June. Saying goodbye to Alabama, but they did have it on Barnaby Jones. Welcome to Alabama, but it was a crime and it ran to Mississippi. <laughs> so you're leaving us in, in June, Miss Jackson? Yeah. So where are you going uh, Virginia. after? Virginia. You're going back to Virginia. Yeah. Most definitely. Your family's from Virginia, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's a good place. New Virginia's Hampton, uh, Norfolk, and Virginia Beach. Yes, ma'am. Well, if your family is there, that's most definitely a good place for you. Got to go where the heart is, you know? Most definitely. Now, my two boys, when I was married to my white ex-husband, he's in the Navy Reserves now. Mm -hmm. And his mama died months ago. Susan, she's about 80 years old. She used to take us shopping and say, we might buy two things, but she had a, a big credit card to go get some more. Between my daughter and me, mm -hmm. we had about 10 things apiece when she swiped that credit card. But um, she died in the nursing home, and she didn't want a funeral. She wanted her ashes to be thrown over the water. Yes, That's peaceful, language. How do you feel about that? Like, how, some people do request that about their transitioning. They do request either to be, you know, a family being able to see their bodies or them being able to, uh, you know. She didn't want that. She, she didn't want to be buried. She just wanted ashes thrown over the water. So how do you feel about that? You feel that, like that whatever? sounds so peaceful. Yes, ma'am. And less regretful. But when your body burns to the ashes, that's kind of scary. Mm -hmm. Even though you can't feel it. But we gotta understand to be absent in the body is to be present with God. So once we are transitioning to the Father, our body is I don't want to say useless, but that's what it is. It don't have any it's type of soul. Is this man walking around? 
We said, oh, no, here he come. But I said, you better listen to him because he's telling the truth. Because yes. it was on a movie where the man walking around saying, you better come to God now because you don't know when he's coming. He said every time he go through that campground and start preaching. I said, you better listen to him. He, he said, God going to come like a thief in the night. You don't know when he coming. Boom. Just like that. Somebody could be hitting a stem and here he come. Ain't that, ain't that crazy? That's the truth. Look, somebody be doing this. Mm. And here come God. Busting out the sky. Ooh, la, la. You better not. That's the truth. That's the truth. That's the truth. So. It was this girl named Miss Flowers. Kitty corner to me and her got baptized one time. And I was Faulkner and she was Miss Flowers. She went back to the stem after she went to church and she said what she saw in the party was everybody on fire. Mm. Smoking. Ain't that weird? Yeah. I know she weird. told the truth. You know, it's not even weird. You know, God give us, you know, people that dream, they don't understand that they actually have a gift of dreaming because everybody don't dream. Well, but she people, had a relapse. People that actually dream and see these visions, that's a gift from God. And he's showing us what's to come. So when you got like people that in your man, life. He walking around. He ain't like he's going to come tonight. That's how we got to. That's how we got to. Every stop what you doing. That's the way he sang. He said, oh, I know I came on time today. Because you know there's a crack house over there. And he stopped right there. And said, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> we got to keep our souls right. That's what matters. So no matter what we're going through, you keep representing them well. I do. And keep them in your heart. Not, not even just representing them, but just keeping them in your heart. Ms. Jackson. I, I have. All the way from Virginia. I know you have. I know you have. Uh, now it's just time to go. I had a nurse crying over me. She said, Those people don't care nothing about you. Better get out of here. Yes, ma'am. Well, we thank you for your time, Miss Jacqueline. We're glad we saw you because we've been looking for you. We're glad we saw you. And mm -hmm. we're glad we saw you before you left. You know what I mean? Because the time yeah. is always right. Because when you well, say you were leaving. Bella, where they at? Where they at? I just saw her over that little store. She the one told me that y'all was looking for me. Yes, ma'am. When, when are you leaving once again? Sometime in June. Sometime in June. I want to go for the summer. I love Virginia in the summertime, the beaches, okay. the amusement parks and everything. So I'm glad we got you before you left, Miss Jacqueline. And we appreciate well, your time. Well, come and see me again before it happens, like before Mother's Day. Most definitely. Or something, okay? Most definitely. We appreciate your time. Now, if you come to 508 and I'm not there, leave the message on the mailbox in your number like his sister did. When she not on the door, nobody answered. She left a note. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Thank you for your transparency. You have a blessed day today.